Something I could do I could be running or I'm chasing you But I won't Cause I got better, better things to do And I spent my precious time Chasing somebody who loves me too If I got a dollar for Every time you slam the door I would be the richest girl alive Life, life If you hadn't run away Every time I asked you stay You would sleep right next to me tonight No, you didn't know me Or you wanted That was a game to play Man, oh man, was Carson Blue lit with her thinking on her live. Child, welcome in, everybody. Glad to have you here. This is another edition of Braley's Virtual Tour Pit Stop. Everything on this channel is alleged, in my opinion, for entertainment purposes only. Once again, everything on this channel is alleged, in my opinion, for entertainment purposes only. Once again, everything on this channel is alleged, in my opinion, for entertainment purposes only. Y'all, shout to Queen C with GG9 and Laurel for coming up. It was a wonderful time last night. We talked about, you know, Stormy's party. We talked about Ready to Low. We talked about relationships. We talked about Extreme Mega Home Edition. There was so much goodness in that nine hour live, y'all. We went live for nine hours, child, and I did my assignment and stayed up. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. First assignment was to deliver y'all the tea. Second assignment was to stay up and not fall asleep. So I did that. We will have a thousand subscriber celebration. And we will also acknowledge the 500 milestone as well. Y'all welcome in. Glad to have you here. So listen, listen, listen. Uh, <laughs> listen. So y'all know I have not been covering Roa since season 15, episode three, right? And that's when the virtual tour concept came to, you know, formation. And so... Lately, um, in the latest episode, rather, of Real Housewives, Real Housewives, rather, of Atlanta or Roa, Kenya Moore fell down, child. Now, I don't know if she was, you know, genuinely walking at her natural pace, because we all have a natural pace when we walk. I don't know if she was, you know, productive, you know, with phone calls or whatever. Or I don't even know if she was gone with the wind, fabulous, and twirling with thoughts of grandeur in her head. But, child... Apparently, there was a wet floor sign, and she fell down. And so, you know, I was trying to think of a song that would really describe this. You know what I mean? And um, this is the only thing I could think, y'all. We fall down, but we get up. We fall down, but we get up. We fall down, but we get up. My, my, for a saint is just a sinner who fell down, but we couldn't stay there and got up. <laughs> Can you more, y'all, is a saint who is just a sinner who fell down, but she couldn't stay there and got up. Child, I was on the phone with a friend. We were laughing. We were talking. We were kikiing. And I literally thought of this song. Now, you know, We Fall Down is just basically an inspirational gospel song to just say, hey, listen, just because you fell down doesn't mean that it's over. Get back up and rise again. But, you know, after you know that we fall down, what do you do after we fall, fell down? This is what you do. What do you do when you've done all you can and it? Seems like it's never enough. And what do you say when your friends turn away and you're all alone, alone? Tell me what do you give 
when you're giving your all and it seems like you can't make it through well you just stand when there's nothing left to do you just stand and watch the lord see you through yes after you've done all you can you just stand child you just stand you just stand stand don't you dare give up through the storm stand through the rain through the hurt yeah through the pain <laughs> You don't bow, you don't bend, don't give up, don't give in. You just hold on, stand, just be strong. God will step in, it won't be long. After you've done all you can, after you've done all you can, after you've gone through the hurt, after you've gone through the pain, after you've gone through the storm, after you've gone through the rain, prayed and you cried, prayed and cried, prayed and cried, prayed and cried, oh my. After you've done all you can, you just stand. Whoa. Do, 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 do. <laughs> now, first of all, I cannot wait to see the comment section. <laughs> Given their take on my singing, y'all listen. Little fun fact, I was in music for most of my adolescent life from pre-K all the way to 12th grade. Um, I, was in, I was in Lab Singers at Parkview, um, Arts and Science Matinee High School, and I got to sing at the Clinton Library. I got to sing at the old State House. I got to sing at the um, old State House for Bill Clinton's 20th anniversary of him running for president. I got to sing at the AKA convention. I got to sing Mozart's Requiem at Robson Center Music Hall. I got to do Medieval Feast, which Medieval Feast is a vibe, y'all. So basically, y'all know Medieval Times and Dixie Stampede at Dinner Theater. Basically, we did that, and there was one song that said, Wassail, Wassail, gather all around. And so we had costumes every year. The best costume I had was this kind of jester hat but i looked really cool though it was blue and gold and i wish i would have kept it but then i probably would have outgrown it and then probably would have been ripped um because the thread the threading and the stitches and all that stuff but anyway so that's a little fun fact about me but yes i just thought that it was just so <laughs> I, I, mean, I mean, how many times does gospel music ever get brought up in the world of Housewives on Bravo? Like, really? <laughs> we fall down, but we get up. And after you've done all you can, you just stand and watch the Lord see you through. <laughs> Y'all, it's all issues and giggles and love, y'all. Listen, I got nothing but love for Kenya Moore. Like I said, shout out to Sherelle's World. Sherelle's World um, is an amazing channel, and I love Perry. Let me tell you something. Perry had me silent, and I rarely get silent. So we were talking about King, uh, not Kenya Chow, um, Candy and Todd, and, you know, how there was an episode where basically, you know, Candy said it was dinner time, and Todd was trying to you know, talk to his production team about this movie and Candy got frustrated. And so the conversation got brought up about, you know, Candy and Todd and that, you know, does Todd not have the right to be his own person? And so I'm like, listen, I think that at the end of the day, um, you know what you sign up for from the partner that you have, but you don't sign up for the magnitude and the hustle and the drive that they have, you know, right? Because Candy, she, she gets her bags, bags. And so, you know, I said, listen, I think that Todd, you know, he comes through and he and he supports, you know, shout out to, to stay at home moms and dads or shout, and shout out to da dads and moms that, 
they try to balance it all. So, you know, I think every parent deserves an escape. Every brother and sister deserves to rise and be great. So then Perry said to me, you know, Braylon, I, I agree with you. And I'm paraphrasing, but this is the part I do remember. He said, do you think that Todd could be on the trunk? I'm like, you know what, Perry? I can't with you. I can't with you. And, and, and Sherelle uses Stephen A. phrase, stay off the weed. Stay off the weed. So shout out. Shout out to Sherelle's War and Perry. Since I mentioned the other good male content creator, shout out to Justin Diego and Bingeworthy. That brother's amazing with the gifts and the memes and featuring people's comments. And, and not to mention that bobblehead. So iconic. He actually did a show on Hulu called Queens Talk when ABC Queens was on the air. So shout out to him. Armand Wiggins. Get in here. Get in here. Get in here, everybody. It's time for a legendary show. I love that brother. Love that brother. Of course, House of Aaron. Blah, dot, dot, dot. Welcome to the House of Aaron, everybody, where we talk about entertainment, pop culture, and anything, everything under the sun. So, like, I, I you know, I, I follow all of them. Like, DJ Richie Sky, he usually doesn't, I don't think he has an intro, but he's, promote, he's promoting The Wickedest Wives, his book series. I have not gotten it, but let me tell you something. DJ Richie Sky, I feel honestly, DJ Richie Sky is going to go mainstream this year. Um, that brother is so good. Actually, there was a person that said, why you do these long form videos? And I was like, listen, as a creator from radio and television and all that, I understood and DJ Richie Sky actually um thanked me in his comment section and then of course kempire you know um welcome to kempire daily where we get all your latest you know pop culture news entertainment so much more you know make sure you click you like the channel click the bell subscribe to notifications where you never miss a video with breaking news when we go live or when we upload child and then make it make sense big memes sexy tell me how you squeeze in the jeans <laughs> You still looking and lurking, still looking and lurking. I'm still here, still right here on it. Okay, <laughs> like <laughs> y'all. I'm telling y'all, I really do watch these people. And let me tell you something. YouTube is TV, baby. Let me tell you something. YouTube is TV. And I also want to mention. Um, Escape the Matrix podcast. There's this um, duo. Now I don't know if they're married or not, but they're but they are duo um, Gamma and Juju. Their channel is ETM Hub. ETM Hub. ETM Hub. It's called Escape the Matrix. They are so so funny. They really really are, and um, I love their dynamic and. Gamma's like, hello, everybody. I'm Gamma, along with the lovely Juju. Um, so I love them, too. Yeah, there's so many good content creators. Of course, Brown Skin Girl, Drop the Mic, Win Tay Talk. Um, of course, Tea Talk with your girl. I'm trying to think who else. True T, Talking Out Loud. Child, there's, there's so many of y'all. Um, trying to think. Trying to think, trying to think, trying to think, trying to think, trying to think. Chit chat with QT De Silva. Trying to think who else. Child, let me let me see. But but that's the majority of them that I know for sure. Um, but yeah, yeah. I mean, listen. There's so many many good content creators out there. It is honestly ridiculous. Um, let me see here. Let me make sure. Um, here for hot tea, of course. How can I forget here for hot tea? Queen Sheba, darling. Um, Black Titanic, shout out to her. Caramel Rail. Caramel Rail, y'all, I need to see Caramel Rail on tour. I need to see Caramel Rail on tour, please, and thank you. She did, um, she was talking about John Legend, and she was saying, we're just ordinary people. I'm not making any love to that. I'm like, I, 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 really? Really, though? But, I mean, you know you want to ride. Let me be good to you, Janelle, from ready to love, baby, I'm ready to pull on those reins at that, at hold down, at that hold down, rather, and go down that road, gonna take Janelle down that uptown road and just 
ride until I can't no more. Okay, I'm sorry. I need to stop. I need to stop. Anyway, y'all, I hope y'all enjoyed. <laughs> look, look, after last night, y'all, after last night and the and the video of my response to how I feel about the streets um, in response to me and that live where, y'all, it was funny. It was um, sad. It was emotional. It was, oh my God, I'm beside myself. It had every emotion. Basically, last night's live was just the human personification of what Inside Out looks like <laughs> in real life. It was live action film. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. We need a laugh today. Like, comment, share, and subscribe from the bottom of my heart, the depths of my soul, the foundation of my being. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for seeing that that's why i'm not the best i'm not the worst i'm number 100 on the short list but somehow y'all still saw enough in me to put me on y'all list because y'all believe i can be a person that can not only produce change create change but distribute change for the good the better and the possibilities of what can be one love much love all love bye bye Something I could do I could be running or I'm chasing you But I won't Cause I got better, better things to do I'd rather spend my precious time Chasing somebody who loves me too If I got a dollar for Every time you slam the door I would be the richest girl alive Life, life If you hadn't run away Every time I asked you stay You would sleep right next to me tonight When you didn't want me All you wanted was a game to play Enemy I held too close Now I